G'day, in this video we're going to be checking to see if your PDF is print ready by the means of outlined fonts or if it is not print ready by having fonts embedded. There's various reasons why artwork should be supplied with fonts outlined. Uh, the typical instance where it's not necessarily required is if it's in a, uh, a booklet or you know, a multi-page document but I'm not going to get into that. Alright, so the first thing that we're going to do is to check if there is fonts embedded. So the first thing to do is we go to File, then Properties, and you'll notice that the first thing that comes up is the Fonts tab, and you'll see that there's a couple of fonts embedded. How can you check that? Well, what I usually do is double click in the artwork. Okay, that looks pretty good. click here, see the cursor, and bang, we can see that that's where there's some fonts. Um, so how do you get rid of them? First thing to do is to select the edit watermark, and we'll click add. And what I usually do is just in the text, I'll type a letter, I'll change it down to say 10 type. This is actually a really bad Let's tell you what, because it's a black background, change it to red so you can see it. And we'll take it back down to 10 now that you can see it. And we'll just chuck the vertical distance to 30. The reason why I do that is so it's outside the crop mark area. So if there's any dodginess that happens from this, it's not going to affect your artwork. Um, happy days. So the most important thing to do is once this is here is making sure that you change the opacity uh, down to zero. Click OK. The next thing is to flatten. So what we do is we convert all text to outlines, convert all strokes to outlines, uh, and we ensure that all pages in the document follow suit and click apply. Don't worry about that necessarily at this stage. And we click OK. So now if we go to File and Properties, we will see that there's no fonts. So one practice I always like to do is to save it as, just in case that you need the original file to find out what the fonts were. And we'll click File and Save As. There we go. I'll we'll append it with OL for Outlined. You can do whatever you wish. Okay, so there we go. There is no fonts. This concludes video two.